Sanbona Zamani Zulu Nation, welcome to lesson number one of our Zamani Zulu, Lenis Zulu online beginner course. Um, so, uh, lesson one, we're going to go through some greetings, um, singular versus plural. In Zulu, it's a little bit different greeting a group of people versus greeting one person. And then, yeah, we'll check out some greetings and surnames. Cool, so some quick vocabulary. Ngi. Ngi, it's I. U, you. Oopsie, sorry, that I hit you. Sorry. Uh, wena, pronoun as for you. Nami, na, this is my little and sign. Nami, and me. Um, yebo, yebo, yes. Pila, lami, mine, hamba, sala, kahle. Cool. So we'll see more of those as we go. Um, cool. So, me, one of me, greeting all of all, group of people. So, if you walk into a group of people, you can greet everybody by saying, Sani Bon. Hello, yo. San Bon. Okay. Sani Bon. All of all. Okay. So, I'm going to ask you guys, or if you're alone, just to pretend you have sort of multiple personality syndrome. And respond in the plural, all of us. Okay. So, sunny born. Hello. Sun born. And you all reply? Yebo. Sau born. Yes. Hello to you. I ask all of you, how are you all? Ninjani. How are you all? Ninjani. You all respond? Sia pila wena unjani. I respond. Nami. Okay, you just said we are well. I say me too. Nami. Um, Gia pila. I'm also well. Gia bonga. Thank you. Cool. So here we've got a little block with a bunch of singular versus plural. Um, Differences. We have saubona, hello to one person. Sanibona. We have unjani, how are you? We have ni, all of y'all, ninjani. Ngiapila, we have ngiapila. Siapila. Wena unjani, you, how are you? Nina, ninjani, how are all of you? How are all of y'all? Nami ngiapila. Uh, Nami is down here. I'm also Nami Yapila versus Nati Siapila. Nati. Nati. All of us. Si. Us. We. We. I'll use this as we. Siapila. Hamba Gashe. Hamba. Go. Gashe. Hamba ni. All of you. Hamba ni. Gashe. Sala kashle, stay well. Sala ni kashle, if you're leaving a group of people, you say sala ni kashle. They would respond. Hamba to you alone. They all responding, saying to you, hamba kashle. Cool. And over here we have um, just some color color coded uh, sort of pronoun. Thingies. Uh, first of all was ni that showed show that was shown first. San ni wana ni is a little thing that means you all y'all. Um, there it is again. Ni all of you ninjani. You are all how how are all of you ninjani? Next we have si. Si this is my sign for si. Si apila wena. Unjani, u, you, singular. Nami, me too. Nami, giapila. Nami, me too. Giapila, giabok. Cool. Let's greet again quickly. Me greeting all of you. Sani bon. You respond. Yebo. Saubon. Cool. I ask all of you. Ninjani. How are all of you? Siapila. 
wena unjani. Na mi giapila, giaboka. Cool. Let's carry on. From the plural greeting, me, greeting a bunch of people, to singular greeting. Me, greeting, just you. Okay, you can get rid of all your other personalities. They're no, long, no longer welcome. Cool. Now, I say to you, Saubon. Okay, hello. Get into more detail here. It literally means uh, sort of, I see you, or we see you. The bona is the C part. Okay, and you respond, yeah, what? Okay, bona, we see it just means, we see it means C. So it's an, an, an acknowledgement of me seeing, acknowledging you as a person, as a fellow human being in this, in this life. And you acknowledge that. Say, oh, cool, thank you. Thank you for seeing me, and we see you, I see you. Sa wu bon. Yes, hello. Cool. Me greeting you. Um, ask, I'm going to ask you, how are you? Unjani. Unjani. You respond. Ngi. I. Ngi apila. Wena. Unjani. How are you? Cool. Actually, let's go back one. Let's practice that again quickly. So, saubon, saubon, yebo, saubon, unjani, how are you? Ngiapil, wena, unjani. Cool. And this is very good um, for going over with Memrise or the Dex app. It's got this greeting on and you can get lots of repetitions just to get this drilled into your head. Cool. So we had, um, hello, how are you? Fine, and you? And you? I respond, I'm also well. Na mi, I am also. Ngia pila, ngia pila, ngia I'm also well, thank you. Cool. Hello, how are you? Next is name. So, what is your name? Ngubani. Ikama. This is my sign for name, little name tag. Ngubani. Ikama. Lako. Cool. What is your name? Ngubani. Ikama. Lako. Ngubani. Ikama. Lako. You say? What well, I say? Sorry. You're asking me, actually. Okay. So, ask me. Ngubani. Ikama. Lako. Very good. Ikama lami gu zamani. Cool. My Zulu name is Zamani. When I was in second year studying Zulu at university, um, I used to I went in and out of the same gate to Varsity every day, and the, all all the Zulu security guard. I used to break my Zulu on him every day. And then one day, going into varsity, he said, Saubona Zamani. And I said, who's Zamani? He said, you. You are Zamani. Because you Zama. You try. You're trying to speak Zulu. Here we go. So that's my Zulu name, Zamani, the trier. Um, cool. Ikama, Lami, Gu Zamani. Gubani, Ikama, Lako. What is your name? Um, and then... Your name is Ikama Lami Gu Jeff. Did I get it right? No. <laughs> I must have got it right for someone. <laughs> cool. Let's do that once more. My name. You're going to ask me Gubani Ikama Lako. Okay? Ikama Lami Gu Zamani. Gubani ikama, name, lako. And you respond, ikama lamingu, Anthony. Cool. Now I'm going to ask you, where do you live? Okay. U, the U, Lala, 
my little sign for live. P, the where, the question. U shala P. Okay, where do you live? And you're going to respond with? Wherever you live. Ngi shala E in, for instance, Eteguini in Durban. You can put wherever you live over there. Um, so, Ushalapi, I'll ask you again. Ushalapi, where do you live? You can say, Ngi Shala, Egoli, Ngi Shala, Cape Town, Ngi Shala, Le Esprungbok, Angas. I don't know. Cool. I'm going to ask you, where do you come from? Um, very common question to ask um, in, in the Zulu thing, um, just where are your roots basically? So you might live in the city, but where, where are you actually from? Where is your family from? Um, often referring to in the Zulu thing, where does your granny live? Where, where are your roots roots? Where are you from? Uvelapi. Cool. So Uvelapi. U is the U. Vela come from. P where. Uvelapi. Um, and you can say Givela, e, wherever you vela from, wherever you come from. Cool. Um, Givela, I come from. So this is you saying Givela, e, Lady Smith, noma e, Escort, noma e, Uppington. Angas. Cool. Now, let's go through that again quickly. So from the live part, I'll ask you, U shala pi. Where do you live? And you can respond, Ni shala e. U vela pi. Okay, my sign for vela to come from. U vela pi. Where do you come from? You can respond, Ni vela. E, from, the E is the from, we're in, at, to, from, all E in Zulu, very useful, cool, wherever you come from. Now, happy to meet you, pleased to meet you, I'm also pleased to meet you, happy to know you, literally, that's what's happening. Ngi, mi, ngi ajabula, uku, quasi. Azi is the to meet or know. Most people might, might know. Angaz. I don't know. Azi is just the, the part, the verb, which means to know. Giajabula uku quasi to know you. And you can respond, me too. Na mi giajabula uku quasi. There we go. So, this might get confusing sometimes. But it's not just goodbye in Zulu, it's either you telling someone to go well or to stay well. Okay, so in this case, I'm telling you to go well. Hamba go gashle. Well, hamba gashle. And you're telling me to stay. Sala gashle. Hamba gashle. Very good. Cool. Now, there's a little dialogue over here. Just adding surnames. Okay, so we're just in Zulu at the moment. Let's see if you understand. Cool. So, Saubon. Your turn. Yebo, Saubon. Unjani. Your turn. Ngiapila. Wena. Unjani. I respond, na mi, me too, ngia pila, ngia bonga, ngia bonga. Gubani ikama lako. And you say your name, ikama lami, for instance, ngu kawe. Really, your name's kawe, how? And you're studying Zulu, how? Name, okay. Ngubani, ikama is over here, isibongo, 
over there. Name, surname. Ngubani, isibongo, sako. Ngubani, isibongo, sako. What is your surname? Okay, and you respond with, with your surname. Isibongo, sami, ngu, ulu. How? When? Ikama, lako, ngu, kawe. Isibongo, sako, ngu, ulu. How? Nzulu, when? You are a Zulu already. Cool. So, I can ask, just for, for, um, for an example, this is just talking to Mr. Ulu. Mrs. Kulu, Mama Kulu, Baba Kulu. U Shala P, Baba Kulu. Where do you stay? Baba Kulu, in this case, stays in Masta. Kwa Masta, Masta, Masta is actually an area in Cato Manor um, Township in Durban, and it means Masta, Mastaule. The houses are so close together. As soon as you exit your house, you're in someone else's space and you shake hands. To kaula is to shake hands. Mas kaule. So close together, you're shaking everybody's hands all the time, saying hello. Cool. U hlala pi. Where do you stay? Baba kulu. And that's just for instance. You respond. Ngi hlala. Ngi hlala. Kwa mas U vela p. Remember what that means. Where, where do you come from? Baba tulu comes from e kwa kwa. You can say ngi vela e kwa kwa. Ngi achabula uku kwasi. Remember what that means. Happy to meet you. You can respond. Na mi gia chabula uku kwasi. Cool. I'm telling you. Hambagashe baba or mama sisi ubuti whoever I'm speaking to. And you're telling me. Salagashe buti. Cool. Well done. We have reached the end of lesson number one. I hope you learned. The greetings go over this lesson as many times as you can and do the memorize course and homework is to greet five zulu people this week cool enjoy go and speak some zulu salani gashe or hambani gashe i don't know if you're coming or going cool bye <laughs>